joined by uh, Coach Mike Carey. Coach, if you just want to give us an opening statement. Yeah, I thought, uh, you know, we come out, we shot the ball very well in the first half. Um, got sloppy. We got up close to uh, up by 40, and then it just got really sloppy. We started doing a lot of substitute. Gave up too many offensive rebounds and, and turned it over too much. But uh, other than that, I thought we shot the ball pretty well. Uh, we did go inside a lot more than what we have been, so that was ha I was happy to see that. And then I was just told Esmeri, uh, 22 rebound or 21 rebounds, the first time since 84, 85, that uh, women's basketball player has done that. So th th that's great. Who, who was it? Olivia Bradley. Olivia Bradley. Okay. So, you know, Esmeri's a big-time rebounder, and she'll continue. She's only a sophomore. She'll continue to make records. Okay, we'll go ahead and take uh, questions for Coach. Just a reminder, use the raise hand feature. First question from Sam. Go ahead, Sam. Hey, Coach. Congratulations on the win. Um, obviously, a much better performance tonight than what we saw a few days ago against Baylor. Um, what, what was the, excuse me, What was the mindset like uh, around the team in, in, in the days leading up to the the days leading up to this? Game? Well, we knew we couldn't have back-to-back -back losses. Number one, number two. Baylor's a heck of a lot better than James Madison. I mean, let's be honest. They're a heck of a lot better. Uh, James Madison wasn't hitting her shots. Uh, and like I said, we executed pretty well the first half and was able to get the big lead. Next question from Nick Farrell. Go ahead, Nick. Coach, first time we've really gotten to see Jasmine Carson. Yeah. What did you think of her performance? And can you just tell us a little bit about what she could bring to you guys this year? I think you saw it. I think she was in in about three minutes, scored 10 points. Uh, she can score. She just got to learn our defense and learn, you know, team uh, defense and that type of stuff. But she can shoot the ball. She can score. She's very athletic. Uh, she wants to be good. So she'll continue to get better, and we'll continue to use her. And once she learns our defense, she's going to be ready to go. Any other questions for Coach? Go ahead, Sam. Coach, um, so five uh, scorers found double digits. Obviously, Kaiser is shooting the ball a lot, but most everybody else kept their shot attempts under 10, um, under uh, in single digits. So last time you were speaking about shot selection was pretty poor. So what did you think about uh, shot selection tonight? Yeah, I thought it was better. I mean, you're always going to have two or three bad shots. But I, uh, other than that, I didn't think it was bad shots. I thought we went inside. Our guards just got to learn when it goes inside, move out the basketball and don't stand there and watch the post play. Because a lot of times they can get a cut, get a layup, or get a wide open shot. And our posts are very unselfish, so they will kick it back out. Any other questions for Coach? Go ahead, Nick. Yeah, so just one more from me, Coach. Uh, you mentioned Esmeri's rebounding performance. Uh, to have her and, and Kari together here as you guys get ready to continue Big 12 play, I, I guess what do, what do you think about your physical presence inside against other Big 12 teams? Yeah, I mean, we rebound. Kari's very physical. Esmeri's very physical. But, you know, we just don't have a lot of height. But with that being said, they play a lot bigger than what they are. And Rochelle, I thought Rochelle Norris come in and did a good job today at the post so that was good to see and defended and rebounded and and and, and scored some so i thought she did a good job too off the bench all right thank you coach thank you